everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today, before I head out, I'm trying to get ready right now, finishing off my makeup. But um, you know what? I'm going to do or try to squeeze in a video so that I can uh, share with you guys my thoughts and first impression on this new mascara from Maybelline. I got this. I bought this at Walmart last week. If you're following me on Instagram at Ellis Daily, I showed it on my IG story. So follow me there because I'm always there. But today I'm going to try this out. We'll do a first impression as always. And yeah, we'll, this one I got at Walmart, but I'm sure it's available at any drugstore here in Canada. So yeah, I got this at uh, for about $7.96 Canadian dollars just because it's a dollar off, but I think the original price was $8.96. So anyway, I got that last week. But today, I am finally trying it out and it's, as you can see, it's still very much in, a, in its packaging. So that's the packaging. And yeah, just very simple. Uh, there's two shades. One is the, the brown one, and but I opted for the very black. Uh, it says very black, 604. And it claims that, let's see, it's new Total Temptations, full fluffy lashes. Four out of five, it says it gives full volume. And what else? Length, so it lengthens, it volumizes. And let's see, Ooh, before and after photo. And it's a waterproof mascara, so we will try that out. We'll go get some water or spray, but later on, because I still have to go out. <laughs> so it says it's a waterproof mascara. Um, lashes go so full, soft, and fluffy. So let's try that out. Let's open the packaging. It's a nice color too, teal. I think the other one's in pink. So let's open that. Okay, so let's smell first. Okay, this one smells like... <laughs> almost like vanilla-ish. But it, it, yeah, it smells good actually. So yeah, that's great. And then the bristles or the brush looks like this. So if we focus it, so it's not the thin kind and it's not overly thick as well. It doesn't have the indention in the middle like the previous mascara that I did a review on. So. This is how the wand looks like. Okay, so now I'm gonna do first coating. As you can see, my lashes are really bare right now. I didn't curl it. I didn't use any um, eyelash curler nor any primer. And I didn't, I haven't really applied any eye makeup on right now except for my, my brows. I just wanna do the mascara. So let's try this Maybelline Total Temptation. Let's do one coat first. I need a mirror, so let's see. Okay. nice you see that guys you see the difference already you see the difference this is no mascara this is with one coat of this Maybelline total temptation mascara hmm I like it let's finish it up maybe two coatings we'll see okay that's really nice Oh wow! Okay, let me go closer. Check that out, guys. So no mascara, one coat. So let's see if I do two coats of this Total Temptation mascara. Let's see.
Wow, okay, volume it is. So I like that. Let's put some in the bottom lashes too. Okay, so this is with two coatings of the Total Temptation Mascara. Uh, the first thing I noticed, it dries up really quickly. So that's that. And this one is no mascara. So can you guys see the difference? I, I like it. Look at the volume that it gives my lashes. It's nice, right? And I did a little on the on the bottom lashes. Yeah, I know that it got it, it dried really quick. So let's see if it transfers. Okay, that's nice. There's no transfer, so it says it's a waterproof mascara, so we'll find that out later on. But as you guys already know that my lids are very oily, so I'm always looking out for mascara that won't transfer on my lids. So uh, up here and down here are my problem with mascara. So hopefully this won't transfer or this and it won't smudge. Okay, so that's the first. Okay, so now I'm done applying the mascara on both of my eyes and this is what my lashes look like with the Total Temptation Mascara from Maybelline and I think I really like it. My first impressions would be it really dried really quickly after the application the first coating i checked it it's dry right away second coating dry right away then transfer on my on my fingers or on my finger when i touch it so that's a good indication of a mascara and then after i applied the first coating it instantly gave my 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 lashes that that lift which um, like what I mentioned earlier, I did not use my eyelash curler, so I like the lift and I like how it opened up my eyes. What do you think guys? I think it did open up my eyes even if I didn't put any eye makeup on except for the mascara right now. So absolutely no eye makeup on. I didn't have any eyeliner or eyeshadow, so just the mascara today and I like how it actually made me look like awake <laughs> what do you think and i like the volume the volume is really good and i could see the difference i took the before and after so i can show you guys and also one with the mascara and one without so now what i'm going to do is going to test it it's waterproof so maybe later in the day we i will maybe spray some water see how it looks like or run this on the water um maybe under the water i'll run the mascara as well and then i want to see like what i always say my lids are very very oily so i want to see if there is going to be transfer up here or on the side here so we will find out out later today okay let's see the time now is 1 49 in the afternoon so it's 1 49 and I will be going out today pick up my kid from school and then we'll go out for dinner and we'll do some extra like some odds and ends because Christmas is right around the corner it's a few more days left and I haven't finished everything yet but just the odds and ends so we'll go about our day and I will let you guys know at the end of the day and I'll update you but um so like right now I am happy with uh, how it looks like and how it applied on my lashes I am really very happy so great job Maybelline I really like it so okay see you guys in a minute I'm going to swipe a little bit here and then I'll run it under water really pigmented and then I'll run it underwater to see how waterproof it is okay guys so I'm back now so I applied this mascara at almost 2 p.m. and it is now 8 12 in the evening so it's 8 12 now and that's like about six hours of wearing this mascara from maybelline which is the total temptation which is this one right here so let's take a that's how it looks like right now after six hours of wearing the mascara the it held the curls yes and let's see what is this I think there's a little smudging in here, like down here, but it's not that much. 
it's not very like See, can you see that? Like a shadow here? Because I didn't wear any eyeliner or anything. I didn't have any eye makeup on today except for my mascara. So, like, it didn't transfer up here. So, that's good. There's no transfer up here. Just a little shadow on the sides down here. So, which I didn't mind. It didn't really, like, only if we take a closer look, that's when you can notice it. But, Really, it's not noticeable from afar, but I'm really glad it didn't transfer up here because if it did, that's, oh my god, that's a no-no for me. But this one didn't do any transfer and it's, yeah, it's really, really volumized still. Um, I posted this on my Instagram stories this afternoon and one commented, cha, hi cha, um, she commented that, she thought it was, it, it looks like a, an um, eyelash extension. So I think that's really one good thing about this. They really make your lashes so full and volumized. So yeah, I'm really happy. I, I, I highly recommend it, you guys, if you really are looking for a new mascara to try. And this is really affordable too. Yeah, go ahead and try this. As you can see, it still like looks so fresh to me. What do you think? If you guys like this kind of videos and if you like more first impression review of other products, if you have any suggestions, other products to try, drugstore, let me know in the comments down below and I will check them out. I will try to buy it for you guys and test it out for you. And yeah, thank you guys for all your support. Have a Merry Christmas if I'm not here again or on YouTube again before or on Christmas Day. Have a Merry Christmas. Have a Happy Holidays. And thank you again so much for everything, guys. You guys are the best. You rock. It's such a good year, 2018. And I'm so ready for 2019. Positivity, blessings to you, to me, and to all of us. So take care. Bye. See you in my next video. <laughs>